How are you grade 6 learners? This is week 7. Divide decimal numbers by powers of 10. After going through this lesson, you are expected to divide decimals up to 4 decimal places by 110, 100, and 1000, and up to 2 decimal places by, one, by 10, 100, and 1000 mentally. Probably, you are wondering about the steps in dividing numbers by 110, 100, 1000, and 10,000. Notice that it is the same as multiplying by 10, 100, 1000, and 10,000. Example, let us divide 5 tenths by 1 tenth. Division of a number or decimal by 1 tenth is actually the movement of one decimal place to the right of the dividend and divisor. Let us divide 5 tenths by 100. Division of a number or decimal by 100 is actually the movement of two decimal places to the right of the dividend and divisor. Let us divide 5 tenths by 100. Division of a number or decimal by 100 is actually the movement of three decimal places to the right of the dividend and divisor. 1, 2, 3. Then add or put 0 as placeholder. Learning task 1. Divide and check. Number 1. 5 tenths divided by 1 tenth. If the divisor is 1 tenth, move 1 decimal place to the right. Number 2. 96 hundreds divided by 100. Since the divisor is 100, move two decimal places to the right. Number 3, 5 and 110 divided by 1000. The divisor is 1000, so move three decimal places to the right. 1, 2, 3. Then add zeros as placeholder. Number 4, 6 and 25 hundreds divided by 100. The divisor is 100, so move two decimal places to the right. Number 5, 37 and 2 tenths divided by 1 tenth. The divisor is 1 tenth, so move 1 decimal place to the right. How do we divide decimals by 10, 100, or 1000 mentally? To what direction do we move the decimal point? If you are dividing decimal by 10, then move the decimal point one decimal place to the left. Example, 78 and 46 hundreds divided by 10. So move decimal point 
one decimal place to the left. The same number of zeros in the divisor. Same with 100. Move two decimal point to left. In 1000, you are going to move the decimal point three decimal places to the left. Learning task 2. Divide and check. Ask your parents to use stopwatch or record your progress in answering the given task. Number 1, 810 and 2 tenths divided by 100. The divisor is 100, so move decimal point two decimal places to the left. Number 2, 72 and 9 hundreds divided by 10. The divisor is 10, so move decimal point one place to the left. Number 3, 960,000 divided by 1,000. Since the divisor is 1,000, move decimal point three decimal places to the left. Let's move 1, 2, 3, then add zeros and also zeros in the ones place. Number 4. 6 and 900, 3,000 divided by 100. Move the decimal point, two decimal places to the left. 1, 2, then add 0 as placeholder. Number 5, 2 and 6,300 divided by 10. Move the decimal point, one decimal place to the left. Number six, four and nine hundred forty three thousands divided by one thousand. Since the divisor is one thousand. Move the decimal point three decimal places to the left. One, two, three, then add zeros as placeholder. Learning task three. Solve the problem carefully by answering the question. Number one. Mrs. Andres has 35,345 pesos and 85 centavos. She wants to give it to the victims of Mount Al eruptions in Batangas, Philippines. How much will its family receive if she decides to give it to 10 families? And this is 35,300 and this is division. We need to divide. 35,345 pesos and 85 centavos divided by 10. So just move decimal point to the left one decimal place. Since the divisor is 10, move the decimal point one decimal place to the left. What if Mrs. Andres decides to divide it to 100 families? How much will its family receive? And the divisor now is 100. Move the decimal point 
two decimal places to the left. One, two. Dividing all numbers by one tenth, one hundred, and one thousand is the same as multiplying the numbers by ten, one hundred, or one thousand. On the other hand, dividing ten, one hundred, or one thousand is by moving the decimal places to the left, the same number of zeros in the divisor. Learning task 4. Choose the letter of the correct answer. Number 1. What is the quotient when 845 and 45 hundreds is divided by 10? Number 2. What is 36 and 79 hundreds divided by 100 equal to? Number 3. How many times greater is 78 and 43 hundreds than 10? Number 4. What will be the answer if we divide 713 and 9 tenths by 1,000? Number 5. What is the quotient if we divide 67 and 54 hundreds by 100 